I see four digits on this in some other videos, but I'm only getting two, so maybe it's 3.2 to 4. How does it do that? It's supposed to be doing 3176 perfectly. Um, there's a brilliant true life bulb just pulsing insanity. Yeah, I've got it on uh, 50 microsecond trigger cycle. Um, the power is dumbed down quite a bit. That's why I could call this a multi wave oscillator. Uh, but you see, this trigger time is it's right. It's right on the bridge of being, you know, 20 micro microseconds or less, or a little bit more even. Um, and you just want it turned it on sharply, and this is anything but sharp. Uh, a lot of those diagrams I do of uh, the P3 Pro are on this, or they're on the, the 20 microsecond mark. Um, yeah, that's what's going on. Uh, let's try another bulb and do some more experiments. Oh, this is something I wanted to check out. I've got my camera, my other camera, cam to cam. Hey, do you want a cam to cam? Uh, do thermal the video. It's pretty sweet. Yeah, it's the cheap one, and I got it remanufactured. Cause I'm Dutch. Um, okay, nothing too bad there. That's for sure. Oh. Nothing too bad heat wise there either. What is that? Why is that knob so hot? Oh, that's just the power. Has a wall jack that's just plugged into the back there. Well, it's not plugged, it's just it's like glued or something. Uh, yeah, uh, I thought that'd show a little bit different stuff than it's showing right now. Usually where you can see these hot spots is either the brain or it's the coil. Alright. Done looking at that. Three thousand forty switch to what are you really what are you really telling me here? That's three seven. It shouldn't touch three seven though. Three one, thirty three, thirty. Um try to see the consistency there. Opening up this time window. One millisecond, two milliseconds, five milliseconds. I want to do that. Ten maybe. No. Twenty. Do ten. Hold. Hold what? All right, we're on 879 hertz now. It's, I was told to hit this hold button. It's supposed to hold the frequency, right? Um, star theory get to know about it. Just kidding. Good radio program though. Good radio. Um, um, better not have broke my oscilloscope. 12, connect. Okay, we're 
attempting to hold this thing. It's actually doing, um, I don't know, I think this is doing a, a fairly decent job for this equipment. Um, we're holding the frequency and it's, let's see if it's playing with the machine at all, if it's continuously doing the frequency. Thought it might start burning it up. Nope, looks fine. It's still not. What? And the, it's still doing this old trick. Hold. Freak. Yeah, it's just on and off. It's telling me it's holding. Um, okay, decent frequency accuracy here. But it's on again, off again. Electromagnetism's pretty crazy. Uh, let's look at it really uh, fine graduations. Yeah, okay. 50 microseconds, that's 100. It's about 50 from all the way off to all the way on. That's it's almost three times um, slower than what it needs to take to get into the cell. Um, that's, that's physics, so it's running 880 hertz, good for it. It's not going to get into the cell because it's going too fast. Around 100 microseconds, it needs to be 20. Um, Start to shrink that down. 50, you don't even see it reaching the peak there, so probably is right around 60 or so uh, microseconds to get to that uh, peak to peak, as you say. And if you look at the harmonics, uh, they're, they're not there because the wave's not shut on quick enough, anyways. Um, 